Mm-hmm. Everybody's got a pistol. Mm-hmm. Everybody's got a forty-five. Mm. And then the philosophy seems to be it. as near as I can see. When the other folks give up theirs, I give up my. This is a violent civilization. If civilization's where I am, mm, mm, mm. Uh, what a fun name. Milwaukee records 24th homicide in 29 days uh, in 2022. Wow. Police, including the police officer. A couple of them, actually. Mm, mm, mm. But this is a story that I I wanted to bring to y'all. And um, this, this, oh, because we voting. Of course, we all voting here. Here's my absentee ballot. I'm going to stick in the mail. Uh, and it's for the local here. Mayor. Um, things of that nature. You know, the mayor. Yeah, the mayor basically. Um, so, who's running? Let me see if I can grab this. Is my man... That's Ernell, y'all. Ernell grew up right down the street. Matter of fact, two doors, houses over from me. Um, now he's the sheriff. Um, and I was torn. Be- and then you got Lena Taylor. Now I'm just hoping after all this time, um, there's something that can be done in this city. Um, I'm not saying that Ernell Lucas is the guy that can do it. Um, And Lena Taylor is another person that I um, admire in terms of her politics. Uh, Now, will either one of them make it? I don't know. I don't know if Milwaukee is ready for uh, a mayor that we select. That is uh, African American, as they say. Okay, so the interim mayor that because Tom Brett of uh, what's his name, uh, Tom Barrett is gone, and he left an interim mayor in there called Cavalier, Cavalier Johnson. So. With that being said, you got these people, you know, running for a uh, mayor and um, county supervisors in some instances. But there's a, a real controversial statement that one of the guys made. And like I said, because there is so much violence going on, it's unbelievable. So it's just unbelievable. And this is in every city in America. Right here, I got a brother, sister charged in 2019 shooting. Uh, Arrest warrants issued. Devontae Terry and his sister, Aisha Glass. A brother and sister have been charged in the October 2019 shooting of a woman near 18th and Stark on Milwaukee's north side. Now, why in the world Devontae Terry has been charged with one count of first degree reckless use of a dangerous weapon? Aisha Glass has been charged with harboring and aiding a felon in regard to the incident. According to the criminal complaint, police were called to a duplex at the above address shortly before 9 p.m. on October 6th for a shooting complaint. Respond. 
think officers noticed the building that had been hit six times with bullets, with three bullets through the lower unit of the building. A woman in the lower unit who was 43 years old at the time was struck by the gunfire and had a gunshot wound to her stomach, she told the police. She heard her upstairs neighbor in an argument earlier, which continued outside. Shortly thereafter, the residents of the lower unit heard multiple shots at which uh, time she was struck, according to the complaint. See, and that's why I said we have to get mental health because we are out of so out of control and mentally that our emotions will allow us to just start shooting crazy. I mean, that's we'll shoot inside of a house in a room no bigger than a closet with kids in it. I mean, this is the mindset. And then the drugs and the alcohol that's on every fucking corner. Y'all don't think that's by design? Y'all think that's by accident that all this stuff is easy access to drive y'all crazy? So then what happens is if you make yourself easy prey for them to put you in storage. This is insane. You, I mean, your whole lives and y'all so young. This is what we see in Milwaukee now. And if it ain't shooting, it's hit and run. According to the complaint, Glass allegedly called her brother, Devontae Terry, and said she wanted them to get get touched. Meaning she wanted him to shoot at her girlfriend's family members. Terry then showed up at the duplex in a tan colored vehicle. Surveillance showed a shooter walking with a limp, wearing a black t-shirt, light colored shorts, and distinctive Air Nike Max, Air Max 97s. In the video, Glass points to the house, to the shooter, before the shooter discharges a firearm six times. I'm sorry. Glass points out the house to the shooter before the shooter discharges a firearm six times at the duplex before leaving in a tan vehicle. Detectives also obtained a observed surveillance video from 43rd and Burleigh, which showed Terry after the shooting at his residence. He is observed wearing clothing which matches that of the shooter from the above described video with a car matching the car driven by the shooter. An arrest warrant has been issued for both Glass and Terry. Now, her and her girl got into a disagreement. She couldn't handle it. So she calls her brother. And he, not using no kind of forethought, decide, they're my people. You know, I got to take up for my people. So he go, she point the house out and they shoot at it. You know, y'all, we are so damn reckless. Every time I think about how easy it is for us to kill each other, I say that goddamn Willie Lynch. That phrase keep popping back up in my mind every time I hear it killing. I can't get it out of my head. <laughs> he says we are going to be perpetually miserable for the rest of our lives don't even worry about us no more if they put that training on us we won't be no good for ourselves only good for them to fill up their jails to do all their dirty work, to build a country. 
only to be treated like shit, be shot down in the in the streets like dogs. And then people wonder where does all that anger go? It where where does all the anger go? All right.